It's just one little grain of sand on the on the, the beach of music. To go back to your uh, to your farm, uh, you said you have no internet connection there and you're very isolated. Uh, how important is it for you to be alone? Uh, solitude is very important to me. I feel like that's when I'm doing most of my writing and, and composing. Um, but at the same time, I do need people as well. And, and um, on my farm, my grandmother also lives there and my uncle also lives there. And uh, we each have our own place on the acreage. But um, we, we keep to ourselves a lot of the times, but we, we interact a lot as well and we help each other out. And uh, so e even when I'm on the farm, I'm not totally isolated, but I think that's what, what everyone needs. You need to be alone sometimes, but also sometimes you need human interaction. And so that's, I get that mostly when I'm on tour. Uh, you know, I get to meet a lot of new people and, and uh, get a little insight into a different culture and, and a different way of life. And, and, um, but solitude is very important to me. Do you have the feeling you have to uh, go away from the Western society so now and then, just on your farm, away from everything? Yeah, and I kind of need both those worlds, you know, and, and um, again, it's, it's so nice to be somewhere that I never thought I'd be a totally different culture than my own, and, and hopefully I can learn from it and uh, bring those lessons back home and, and um, mentally masticate them and, and, and make them work for me. But uh, yeah, the farm is definitely where I feel most at peace. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, on Animals in the Dark, uh, lyric-wise, it's a pretty heavy record, but at the same time, uh, you can hear hope as well. Uh, what, what did need to happen for you to write that record? Um, well, the, I, I feel like uh, it was a reaction to a lot of things that were going on in the world uh, over the past few years. And I just realized that these things have always been going on in the world and there will always be tyrants. There will never not be war. We as humans are just flawed creatures uh, in that way. And, and so we just always are fighting for control. And, and um, when I look out my window on the farm and I see different birds on the feeder, I've got a bird feeder there and the finches don't get along with the Blue Jays and the Blue Jays don't get along with the Cardinals and the Cardinals don't get along with the, uh, the, the black capped chickadees and, and they're each fighting for control of the feeder and it's just a perfect metaphor for human beings. I mean, every animal has their version of it and we're, we're all fighting our own battles and, and, uh, but humans have it down to a science of, of you know, this, this war machine so that being said, that's been going on since the beginning of time. Since, since a man could pick up a club and, and club another man, uh, we've, been, we've been fighting each other. But the good news is that we, there's also beauty and there's love and there's art. And so I've discovered that even though that evil's always existed, the way to counteract it is by making something beautiful, whether it's painting a picture, taking a photograph, smiling at someone, kissing your girlfriend, writing a song, that's, those are things that the, uh, the tyrants can never take away from us. And so this, this record was my little attempt to, to try to make something that mattered. And, um, and like I said, it's just, it's just one little grain of sand on the, on the, the beach of music that's out there. And, and it's not any more important than anything else. It's just my little attempt. Yeah, it's somewhat like a, like a balance, beauty versus evil or something like that. Yeah, yeah, and I've just discovered that I, I can't pick up a sword and go fight battles. My, the way I fight is uh, with music. Yeah, at the moment, in what way is the, is the balance more towards evilness or more towards beauty? That's a good question. I think it goes back and forth all the time. Um, and it depends on your viewpoint. But uh, On your view? I, I think, I think uh, beauty and, and, and love tend to win out. Um, it's, it's hard to believe sometimes when I see what's going on in the world and there's so much chaos and so much death. But, uh, I mean, here we are talking about music and, and uh, I, think that, I think that's going to win out in the end. Well, why, why can music win instead of uh, people smashing each other's heads? Well, because music is, uh, when it's done correctly, is, is pure and, and hopefully can af can affect people more than um, violence or, or evil.